My name is Yas. I own the shop. Yeah. When I prepare this coffee, I mean, you've seen me do it. Yeah. And just to make it uh, clear, I put the coffee grounds in there. In a separate pot in there, I boil the water. When the water is boiling, I pour it over the coffee and then I return it to boil just once. And now we have this dark kind of looking thing on the top. Yeah. So I start off with a couple of spoons of cold water on top. I'm just going to kind of like separate the coffee grounds from the rim in this little pot. And then I'm just going to kind of like scoop up all the dark bits and release them so that the coffee grounds can fall through towards the bottom. Just like the first sip only happens once, the scream only happens once. Once it's gone, there's only dark liquid left. So I'm going to transfer all this nice cream into your cup. Now we can pour. And the coffee's been served. You have some yeah, clean water yeah. here to cleanse your palate if you wish. Here's some Turkish delight with walnut flavor. And bits inside as well. Here's your coffee from over here. sugar in my coffee but yeah said you're supposed to dip the cube in the coffee and then just bite off the corner and take a sip and let the bitter coffee mix with the sweet sugar rest it on your tongue. Any excuse to do the sugar cube. It is actually really nice. So there are these local guys that supposedly jump off this bridge right up here. We've yet to see anybody jump. They've just walked around and asked for money. Apparently they wait till they get 25 euro before they jump. So, so far we've just seen a lot of guys standing in speedos up on top of the bridge. But we're going to hang out down here in hopes of capturing somebody jumping within like the next 20 minutes and then we'll probably give up for like the third time. <laughs> Oh, he's going. He jumped! Oh, he jumped. He didn't dive. Back to collecting money from the tourist. Nate got his ice cream. Thank you. Ice cream with a view. Oh, yum. How is it, mate? Chad loves it. We stayed there long enough to watch two guys jump off the bridge. Now we're heading back to the hostel to grab the car and we heard about this really cool monastery that's like 10 kilometers outside of town, so that's where we're heading. Wonderful. Beautiful. I tried to be healthy and order the salad, but it turns out the salad's just made from potatoes. Not bad. Too. Ooh, the fish looks great. Good portions. Thank you. Kara, how was lunch? It was okay. I'm gonna give the location like a eight and a half. We're like as close as you can get to the whole reason we came I here. Think that would be a ten. Okay. Because you're overlooking the whole river and your next monastery. We're down here. It's still really good. Eight and a half is good. Okay. And you have the price a 10 because we're in an awesome location and it was only like seven, six or seven dollars a plate, which is really good for a tourist location. And the food was like a solid seven and a half. So get? all in all, the place gets like a eight uh, yes, and a half? Service brings down the average. Shh, gosh. <laughs> Pretty much no fun. We 
made it to the monastery. That's it right there. We heard that it really wasn't worth going inside. There's also like a little boat you can take about two feet into the cave. <laughs> I heard that wasn't worth it either. It's really pretty though. Worth the short trip out here. Close game. Yes. Oh, shot. Ah! No. <laughs> Maid has been defeated. Maybe next time we should turn the camera on when we start it. <laughs> it's now dinner time after the monastery. We went back, we did a little work, we rested, and now we're heading out to eat. We are going back to Guillermo's because she was just so nice. It's the same place so we good. ate yesterday. You know, it might not make the best vlog content, but the food was fantastic. My favorite part of my lunch yesterday with all of the meat was the bread and the cheese. So tonight I got a cheese sandwich. It's huge. Mm. Got a little sauce all the way over here somehow. <laughs> right. Wow. This looks fantastic. How much was this? Ten? No, I get ten. This entire plate costs like five US dollars. Am I supposed to swallow the coffee with the sugar? No, it's good. It's very sweet. <laughs> I think I took too big of a bite. Right, please. What's the secret, Chad? It's called the Kentucky Fast Five. <laughs> <laughs> Guillermo is going to be so excited to see us. <laughs> it was Australian. Guillermo is going to be so excited to see us. <laughs> Kara really wanted to redo that shot. <laughs> because the Australian accent was so bad, so we'll give you a shot to redeem yourself. I thought it was good. Charlie said it was bad, but I'll try again. Guillermo's good. <laughs> I'll try my Kentucky accent. Guillermo's going to be so excited to see us. Much better, I think. Yes. I think y'all know that she's doing so much better. <laughs> Chad's accent's that. gotten very well. Gotten very good. <laughs> This is just a disaster. I was gonna say we need doing food. Very we're well. a train wreck. We need food. 